Hi, I'm Doug Ingram, the Vice President of Product Management at Brocade. And today we're here to talk to you about uh, two important product announcements. The first is an 8x10 gigabit line card for the MLX router, and the second is a 64 port line card for our DCX backbone. Each of these new product introductions both strengthen and simplify networks for our customers. Increasingly today, as you're either building private cloud or public cloud infrastructures, what you need with the new types of data like video traffic coming across the networks in greater density and also the increase of mobile devices that are bringing uh, hundreds or millions of new users onto the networks, that data explosion is forcing you to build out higher performance and line rate non-oversubscribe cores for both your data center and your service provider networks. What these two new important product introductions are doing is allowing our customers to leverage their existing investments in both the MLX and DCX to build out those high performance, non-blocking line rate core networks. The new 8x10 gigabit line card for the MLX router increases the MLX density from 128 10 gigabit ports to a industry leading 256 ports in a single router platform. The new 64-port card for the DCX backbone increases the number of ports on the DCX from 384 8 gigabit ports to 512 ports of 8 gigabit fiber channel. This increase in density allows our customers to have a lower overall cost for per port on a total chassis basis not only in terms of the amount you spend for the initial purchase on a per port basis, but also it reduces the overall power and cooling expenses that you will have over the lifetime of the products. And speaking about operating expenses, each of these line cards now allows the MLX and the DCX to have a greater number of non-oversubscribed or lawn rate ports in each of the boxes. That will greatly simplify your network design as well as allow you to handle peak loads. And as your networks become more dynamic as we move to a cloud environment, it also allows you to overall simplify your network design as you're not trying to design your network around bottlenecks or around oversubscribed line cards that exist in the platforms. Switching to the CapEx side of the equation, each of these product introductions significantly increases the density for both the MLX and the DCX. This means you need to buy fewer platforms. As well, you will need fewer links between the switches and routers that you can now use for connectivity to servers or to storage. As a customer, you know it's not just about CapEx and OpEx savings, but also about leveraging your IT assets for increased business agility. Building the right network is an important part of that. These two new product announcements allow you to build with the MLX and DCX, a highly scalable, high-performance carrier and SAN infrastructure that will allow you to handle dynamic and peak workloads that will help you build a simplified and strengthened network for your public and private clouds.